in some financial reports figures are presented in significant digits for instance instead of showing the number 1,234,567 you could choose to round the number to one significant digit this would mean displaying the same number as one and six zeros rounding the above number to two significant digits would show the number as one two and five zeros if you need to round a number to a given number of specified digits or figures you can do so with a formula that uses round log 10 abs and int functions at the core this formula is rounding the number using the round function equal to round number comma x where x is the number of digits required the tricky part of this formula is to calculate x this is a variable because it will change depending on the number being rounded so to round 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 to an increasing number of significant digits we would have minus 6 minus 5 minus 4 and so on so we must calculate number of digits in the round function depending on the number and significant digits notice how when the results are expressed using exponents as in scientific notation the exponent is 6 in all cases this can be calculated using the following formula abs converts the value to an absolute positive value log 10 gets the exponent in this case 6 with the decimal value int trims off the decimal part of the exponent to figure out the number of digits to round use the following formula the formula uses the exponent and the supplied significant digits numbers are in column a and significant digits in column b so we need to use the following formula 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 has been rounded to significant digits 1 2 3 etc here is another formula you can use first abs function removes any negative symbol that may exist and then the int function strips the decimals the len function is used to get a measure of how many characters are in the number without any decimals or negation symbols in this example this part of the formula results in the number 7 this number is then multiplied by minus 1 to make it a negative number and then add it to the number of significant digits this gives the number of digits to use in the round function numbers are in column a and significant digits in column b so we need to use this formula 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 has been rounded to significant digits 1 2 3 etc if you like this video please subscribe to our channel